This is the Kingston Data Traveler 2000 USB flash drive with 256-bit AES hardware encryption to protect data. It's OS independent with no software required. Getting started with the DT2000 is easy. To log in using the default pin, just press the key button once. The red, green, and blue LEDs will flash once, and then the red LED will continue to blink. Within 10 seconds, enter the user pin to unlock the drive. The default pin is 11223344. Then press the key button, and the solid red LED changes to green to show successful pin entry. Note, once the DT2000 is unlocked, the green LED will remain on for only 30 seconds, during which the drive needs to be connected to a USB port. It can be locked down immediately by holding down the key button for three seconds, by waiting for the 30 seconds to expire, or by clicking the safely remove hardware and eject media icon in your operating system. Now to set your personal pin, press the key button once. The red, green, and blue LEDs will flash once, and then the red LED will continue to blink. Within 10 seconds, enter the user pin to unlock the drive. Then press the key button, and the solid red LED changes to green to show successful pin entry. Now press the key button twice. The blue LED blinks. Now within 10 seconds, begin to enter the new user pin. The blue LED continues to blink. Press the key button twice. The green LED blinks. Now within 10 seconds, begin to re-enter the new user pin. The green LED continues to blink. Press the key button twice. Now the red solid LED changes to a green solid LED, indicating that the user pin change was successful. If you make a mistake while setting a new pin or don't complete the procedure, don't worry. The drive will retain the old pin. To protect data from brute force, if the user enters an incorrect pin 10 consecutive times, the encryption key will be deleted, along with all the data on the drive. The drive will have to be reformatted. This is the Kingston Data Traveler 2000 USB flash drive. This video will demonstrate how to use its read-only mode and its timeout lock mode. The read-only mode restricts write access to the drive. First, unlock the drive using your pin. The solid red LED changes to green, indicating successful use of the pin. Enable the options by pressing the key button three times. The green and blue LEDs will blink together. Within 10 seconds, press number seven, followed by the number six. Then press the key button once. The blue LED fades to a solid green. When the drive is inserted into a USB port, the green LED blinks every two seconds to indicate read-only mode. We've applied a naming convention that makes it easy for users to remember the keystrokes for each optional setting. In this case, the number seven and six uses the letters RO for read-only. To disable read-only mode, unlock the drive using your pin. The solid red LED changes to solid green. Now, enable options by pressing the key button three times. The green and blue LEDs blink together. Now within 10 seconds, enter the number seven, then the number nine, and then press the key button once. The blue LED fades to a solid green. We've applied a naming convention that makes it easy for users to remember the keystrokes for each optional setting. In this case, the number seven and nine uses the letters RW for rewrite. The Data Traveler 2000 can be set automatically to lock after a specific amount of time. This feature can protect against unauthorized use when the drive is connected to a host, but unattended. The timeout lock has to be activated and can be set for any time between one and 99 minutes. First, unlock the drive using your pin. Now, enable options by pressing the key button three times. Within 10 seconds, enter the number eight and then the number five. Press the key button once, then within 10 seconds, enter the length of user timeout in two digits. Press the key button once to enable timeout lock. We've applied a naming convention that makes it easy for users to remember the keystrokes for each optional setting. In this case, the number eight and five uses the letters TL for timeout lock. Now to disable the timeout lock, first unlock the drive with the user pin. Then enable options by pressing the key button three times. Within 10 seconds, enter the number eight and then the number five. Press the key button once. Then within 10 seconds, enter the number zero twice. Press the key button once and the timeout lock is disabled. This is the Kingston Data Traveler 2000 USB flash drive. 
It's easy to reset the drive to the default pin and erase the data when needed. This operation is handy when the user has forgotten their pin or when you need to reset the drive for a new user. Please note that all data will be erased and data recovery will not be possible once a new encryption is created. First, press and hold the number 7 and then press the key button. The red and green LEDs will blink alternately. Release both buttons at once. Within 10 seconds, enter the number 9 button three times. The red and green LEDs continue to blink alternately. Press and hold the number 7, then press the key button. Release both buttons. The red LED will fade out to complete the reset process. The drive has been reverted to the default pin and will now have to be reformatted.